Hello and welcome back to the second episode of Every Day We Fight. Today we're actually going to do some gameplay and we do only have one mission available so far. Uh, it is a wrench in the machine uh, which uh, will uh, lead, lead us uh, to fight against a lot of aliens in order to sabotage that machine. So let's go and jump directly into it. That's it. The old Ragosa Hotel. Looks like the Cognos are using it for local headquarters. You serious, Leo? What we need isn't there? Afraid so, Dylan. You seeing the same number of assholes as I am? We can't just stroll in and ask for a room. Vivian, thoughts? There's a bus depot not far from here. Might have something we can use. Worth a look. Good, so... Keep your eyes open. There's Although the hotel is over there, uh, we actually need Grab to find something go. completely different. And let's start with Dylan, our frontliner, who has a med kit and a shotgun. I like that. We're then going to Vivian, uh, who might be able to use the long haul. I like that. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. Uh, we don't want uh, the scope here. Unequip that. And equip it instead onto our sniper. It's a bit uh, tedious at the beginning because uh, the weapon menu uh, is not yet very well done. Okay. And I think stock scope. No. How can I drop that one? Ah, okay. I see, okay. Okay. Hmm. Well, see, uh it's a bit uh it's a bit confusing still. So, apparently we are we are sharing all of uh, the attachments incompatible with the weapon well that's okay good we're going to get that in a second leo here is going to take hailstorm takes the stock and uh, takes the frag grenade Dylan takes the smoke bomb on top. That's not bad either. And I think finally we... Um, finally we wanted to equip all of the weapons. Why is that? Oh, that's potentially yet another weapon. Yeah, okay. Well, we got an attachment that no weapon can use. Well, that's the beauty of running completely random equipment at the beginning. Every time I run this mission, uh, you get different equipment. So uh, that um, in itself makes it unique. And because you need to adjust your tactics to whatever you have been given. Dylan, in this case, will be our frontliner with a shotgun. Uh, Vivian will be our sniper and Leo will be kind of uh, the mid-range fighter. So uh, let's talk a little bit about all of the civilians here. Can't that remember how long these people have been like this. Hang on, there's a harvester here. Son of a, the Cognos are extracting elixium in the middle of the city now. Viv, there are a way around this. Maybe. But we gonna let this operation go unpunished? Not a chance. Very well. The depot can wait. Let's clear out these cognos and destroy that thing. Their harvesters are well armored. Then we find vantage points where we can target its power cells. No targeting its power cells from down here. Need higher ground. Let's be smart. We have the element of surprise. For now. Let's get some payback. Good. So... <clears throat> a couple of uh, things uh, to note. Number one, we want to sneak. Number two, we want to split up. And number three, you can see those little bubbles. These are the power cells. 
You can only shoot at them from Power a cell specific inside. angle. Uh, matter of fact, from that angle over here. So you can't shoot uh, from below. Uh, which means we need to position ourselves in a way that we can hit all three. Um, I'll stay here with Dylan. Vivian uh, will do two things. Number one, there is a free med kit, and I can't let that go to waste. There we go. Got the med kit. And now we're sneaking out. And I would like her to actually stand on the other side. up here has proved to be super valuable also it allows us to hit the power cells from the other side we actually need three uh, different positions to hit all three power cells i see a power cell see from here you can hit one of them good we're hiding and then finally leo his rifle and his frag grenade. We'll put him right over here to get a good position. Very similar to the last time. And that's what I mentioned once you understand how the missions work. Kind of becomes uh, pretty straightforward. We're hiding here. And let's begin to aim. And stop this game. Combat is initiated. Thank you. Couple of uh, things here. Uh, four starters. in the open here I learned from uh, the last time I'll put that one down good we could uh, now trigger kill assist as you can see this guy is climbing down. Oh, come on. Well, that's it not work out as uh, intended at all which means we need to donate our AP don't hold back Dylan Leo on the other side tossing a grenade Oh, what? They can evade? Oh, wow, I didn't know that. Okay, well, you learn something every single day. Uh, back into full cover here. Okay, well, not good.
go lean into cover. Okay, Saiken, you better believe that because you can't hit the guy. But we could overwatch, right? Um, how did overwatch work? We'll figure that out in a second. Uh, I would like hologram out. Hologram to be placed down here. And then I would like to. Oh, we have no ammunition. Oh, great. Reload. Swap weapon. Let's try that again. And let's lean in out of cover. Nope, that didn't work. Back into cover. Well, that was a turn uh, to, of course, showcase how it's not done. Uh, Dylan still has seven AP left over. to be hit by that other guardian we do have a smoke bomb our question is will that help us down here or should we just smoke this area you know what I let's smoke, smoke this area just making sure that we're not being flanked Good. End of turn. Still haven't figured out how to overwatch properly. Enemies are moving in to get that hologram. Hologram down. Which kind of brings us to that one on one location here. Good, we can scramble now, so I will trigger that. You won't get me! Completely annihilate this guy. Very good. Leo is out for now. Sixteen. How much is this? Ten and six. Okay, good. Let's try it again. Come on. Kill the engineer. Or the guardian. Unfortunately, we could not immediately uh, kill it with a pistol. Good. 
that's two down. And we are in reasonable, uh, reasonably good cover. So I think we can just end the turn. So. We're going back. Good. We're definitely in good cover here. Um, let's get over here. Careful with the explosive. I hope the enemies have not figured out how to use that. Engineer is coming closer. Um, we're going to hold our breath and then <laughs> full auto. Okay, engineer is injured. That's a good start. Here into full cover. Oh, I'm this the guy. One you Come on. We can't really hit him from here, and might as well. <laughs> might as well start hitting him with a pistol. Okay, cool. Well, that's the start. Uh, reload the weapon. Down to 13. How much time would that cost? Six. Uh, not enough to actually kill, uh, to actually hit someone. It's not a bad position. Let's lean into cover and yeah, just get a couple of shots off. Engineer moves up. Highly injured at this point. Guardian. Try to Shit. move into the other side. I don't know if we should really scramble. Yeah, I think we're good. That's we're not, not gonna happen. We're in super full cover. Definitely got that one. And we are starting to move over here. Okay, we're trying full auto. Okay, well, lesson learned today, don't full auto into a ranged enemy. 
No, I think I we're still having so. good cover here. Yeah? Okay, easy. As long as you're staying in full cover, my lesson so far is don't sweat it if you have full cover. But unfortunately, the hitbox is not correct. Nah, well, to be expected. These are the little uh, things that are not working out well yet. I think we're clear. So Good. let's focus on the harvester. Everybody get into their positions. I haven't even taken a single point of damage here. Power cell spotted. Good. Well, that's a proper position. Nah, that was wrong. That is a proper position. And that's a proper position. Okay, cool. So, what we want to do is we want to aim. Enemy reinforcements are coming in, uh, so hide here, uh, aim and two down, just one more. Aim and There down. it goes. Let's fend off these asshats. Good. Reinforcements Heads up. are coming. We're not out of this yet. Let's deal with that in a second. All right, reinforcements are coming this time with new enemies and new mechanics. So armor and shields, uh, body armor is particularly weak against sniper rifles and revolvers. Uh, shields for sentinels are weak against shotguns and explosions. All right, well. Full-fledged crew of enemies has just landed. More reinforcements are coming in next turn. Okay, that's definitely more than I bargained for. Son of a... Uh, we're triggering a scramble. Could have gone further into hiding. Oh boy. Dylan is definitely taking a couple of shots here. Good, but now it's uh, our turn. Uh, Dylan. Takes a med kit. Good, very good. Uh, if we're sucker punching, uh, that would be enough damage to get one down, but not both. Okay. If we're shooting, on the other hand. That'll be like what? 9 AP? Uh, 
are not good enough. No, no, no. Alright, engineer takes a sucker punch. Goes down. One more sucker punch. going into full cover here. Dylan definitely has good abilities in melee combat. His sucker punches are enormous. Let's hope these guys are moving in. Um, so, just out of curiosity, can't directly shoot down there, okay. And the reason is we have no ammunition. Well, fantastic. Let's change that, shall we? these open zones uh, for the enforcer that the game was talking about. Reload uh, not available yet. Yeah, certainly not going to shoot uh, him with a pistol. Um, I think what we can do is we could uh, try to move around somewhere here. That would be an option. Almost into cover here. That's not a bad option. All right, Vivian. Leo has the high ground uh, over here. I have to wonder. More reinforcements are coming. More reinforcements are coming. We're a little bit left alone to our own devices over here. I think we could take a few shots and then overwatch. Um, yeah, single shot. <laughs> Moving this guy back, okay. a shot and then we are overwatching I'll cover this way good well let's see if my overwatch trap actually works Here you're we go. in my personal space oh yeah we're uh, triggering proximity punch yes please <laughs> down okay and force also moves down okay engineer moves down uh, these guys are close to an explosion here that's good oh boy lots of damage Not 
sure if uh, the idea was to trigger all of the enemy packs at the same time. It seems like I've maybe gotten more than I bargained for. Okay, we're scrambling to here. I've got this one. So effed. And all of them seem to be moving towards our sniper. Not sure how this is going to go. Potentially we'll lose the mission. Let's start with Dylan here, shall we? <laughs> I need to go out, uh, elsewise this is going to go very, very badly for us. Maybe here and then I can scramble back. We could taunt someone. But before we do that, uh, let's just blow them apart. I do have an idea. Leo over here donates 10 AP. Come on, Dylan. You got more in the tank. Dylan. Gets the guardian down. over here uh, I thought he would be in cover apparently I was wrong well I hope he can scramble reloading Pretty much it. Enforcer will be moving up. That's not good. If he moves up, let me see. I think we could kill him with that. Uh, with that. So. What I will say is, we're just going to overwatch up here. Ready for anything. And that's end of turn. That was foolish. No, he survived it. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. Okay. Wow. Okay, he can't survive an explosion. First enemy that I encounter who can survive an, uh, an explosion. That's not good. Then it scrambles back.
Well, that's the disadvantage of not knowing the game too well. <coughs> Some of these enemies will surprise you. Good, we're reloading. We've got 14 AP. And I think I would like to overwatch. Ready for them here. Good, Dylan. Reloads. And we do not have anything. So, might as well just wait here. Okay, why did Overwatch not trigger? <coughs> Don't know. But we're being swarmed. When someone is really close to you, the whole weapon thing kind of goes out of the window. <laughs> Instead, punching becomes more of an option. We know someone is coming up here and there are guys down there so question is should we position ourselves over here uh, that might open shots from down there we could position ourselves back here problem is Dylan is very much trapped right there If anyone area. comes up here, we can overwatch. Uh, Dylan. Dylan could theoretically move to here, should once move back in. Okay, I still haven't fully understood how the AI works, I would have guessed they could uh, scramble us much faster than they I'll did. I'll knock the dumb right out of you. So far, they have not yet got to us. Let's start over here. Let's move further into cover. And um, 
Well, I don't want to get KO'd, so I think what I'm going to do is she's just healing herself. Next turn, we're going to hologram. Dylan is in a super strange position here. Sucker punching, I want to, I want to shoot. Uh, got twenty-three AP. Good. Guardian took damage. Uh, if the enforcer moves up, we're sucker pun uh, punching him again. Can't really move somewhere else, so Dylan is fine where he's at. Ramble into more hunger. That's my ah, taking fire. Get us hit, but no. Son of a. So we're scrambling back. Can't believe that Dylan is tanking like five enemies just by sitting in cover, moving back and forth, back and forth. We have no more ammunition, but that's okay. Uh, Dylan still has his sucker punches. If I learned anything about this game, sucker punch is good. is completed under crap. Good. Let's place a decoy right there. Did that work? No, I think we have just bugged the game. Can't punch anymore, nor can I place decoys. Okay. That's not good. Where are you going, shithead? Crap, crap, crap! Only thing that we can do is scramble. Oh! Uh, yeah, it sucks out. being KO'd uh, due to a game bug. Oh, shit! I'm in trouble! And now Dylan starts to be in trouble. This does not look good, guys. Can Dylan carry this one? That's the question. Reload. And... Let's 
kill this guy. And end of turn. Yeah, we're not uh, doing too well here. I think I need to get Vivian back up, so Dylan needs to move over, try to get his friends up. They are unfortunately too far apart from one another. Good, let's see what one person can do in this game. Dylan moves over. trying to just kite them for now get our friends back up and then with more action economy we might be able to get back into the game Big enforcers are definitely a problem. I really found a good way of dealing with them yet. Okay, well, hmm. running over here is a bit suicidal, but unfortunately, we can't really do anything. Need to get to those crates and then get over here. Uh, Dylan, what are you doing? I mean, we could go in and kill this one guy that is following us. That might be the play here. These guys can come up. Full cover for now. Seems like the right play. Nah, I'm not going to be able to hit him. So if we continue to sprint, um, could we position ourselves down here? Yes, we could. But is that a smart idea? They'll be able to charge to us. And that's two guardians. Good. We'll take the full cover over here. End of turn. Okay, and Forza needs to reload. That's not bad. Scramble to over here. Ooh, he had more movement than I anticipated. The ladder uh, takes a lot of movement. He can't shoot, can he? Okay, well, I mean, look, as you could be positioned to hold for now. Uh, the other option, can't sprint, damn it. The other option is to sprint all the way over here and then trigger the guardian, but that would be deadly. No, no, no. You need to 
take full cover. All right, Dylan. Big mistake, dipshit. If I trigger that, he will send in the open. But if I don't, he will be killed. This guy is just reloaded, right? Bastards got me. Yeah. All right. Well, we give it, uh, gave it our best. Uh, that is uh, how you not uh, do the mission. A um, couple of bits of feedback around gameplay. I think uh, it's a bit counterintuitive to have uh, three objectives and you do all three and then you get punished by even more reinforcements. You could have easily done it by just killing uh, one of the cells, kill the reinforcements, kill another cell, kill the reinforcements and so on and so forth. Uh, but the mission never gives you that um, indication. So that in itself was um, not well done. Uh, and I think there should also be an incentive for trying to get all three at once. The second one is it absolutely sucks to uh, lose miss missions because of uh, the uh, bugs that are still there. It is what it is, it's an alpha, so I'm not too concerned. But I could have definitely hold my own uh, with my two operatives if there wouldn't have been the bugs. And the third one is uh, just lack of knowledge. I thought the explosions would deal enough damage to kill everyone. Clearly I've been uh, proven wrong. Uh, that's on me. I definitely own uh, the death of uh, the operative here. But the other two really were um, gameplay related ones, which is a bit unfortunate. I definitely liked how, how much you can take on with a single operative if you position yourself well. Uh, the interrupts um, are okay but limited um, in the way that they work. For instance, the last one, I wish we could have waited a bit longer so that the guy uh, really comes uh, comes charging in. Then we suck a punch and go back into cover. Something along those lines to not have uh, failed the mission. But yeah, it is what it is. I think good um, gameplay uh, indication of the current situation of the game. It's a fun little rumble um, and I will give it another try off camera. Thanks for watching guys and have a good one. Bye bye.